Hey guys, this is Carmen. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you like handbags, accessories, pendant, right charm bracelets, this is the place to be. So guys, I this is a requested video by Mono's Beauty. She actually asked to see my green bags and to see the green bags that I have in my collection. You would think that green being my favorite color, I will have a tons of green bags, but that's not the case. I only have one, two, three, four, six green bags and they all different shades because i figured I, I, one thing that i try not to do in my collection is have multiple of the same color even if it's different shapes or different silhouettes because i will always reach out to my favorite silhouette like right now i'm looking right now i have like about just looking in my shelves i have three natural bags so by when it's time for me to grab a bag, I will gravitate to the bag that I like the most. So I don't see the point of getting multiple bags of the same color in different silhouettes because you're always going to gravitate to one bag. So when it comes to choosing colors, I like to, to, um, how I put it to choosing colors. I like to be, I like to add colors that I don't have in my collection at all. So, oh, I forgot I have another green up there. So I got, I got another, I, I just saw another green bag. Okay, so I'm just going to go according to how I got them. Like which, which bag I got first, second, third, just like that. So my first green bag was um, a Dunienberg medium satchel. And this was in the color Ivy. I got this bag, I would say, hmm. My son is about to be 19. So I probably got this bag over 10 years ago. Probably more. About 10 years, I think. So this is the color Ivy and it's very pebbled. And I'm so, so surprised that it's not um, dry. Because the last time that I took this bag out, it was extremely, extremely dry. So this is this was my first green bag that I added to my collection. Well, my husband added to my collection. So that was the first one. Then the second one that I don't really use this bag much, but I love the silhouette. And this is the Dunienberg Sip Sip Satchel. And I believe this is the, me this, the medium because I know they have a small one. And this is more of like a green, but also like a teal. I don't know. It's green, but it's not a rich, rich green, as you guys can see. So this is that. I haven't used this bag in, in a long time. So this was the second green bag that was added to my collection. Now, the third bag was this. Michael Kors ba Blakely, I believe that's the name, Blakely. And this is a drawstring bag, and it has uh, the strap here that you can make it as a crossbody, and you could also hold it as a, as a satchel. I love this bag. I think this is one of the most used green bags in my collection. I like it because it's very spacious and fits everything in there is lightweight and it's also um just nice and chic i like it also because the strap i could also use it as a crossbody it's not a big bag so it's nice it will be nice to use as a crossbody and i can just use it as a top handle as well so that was the third then the fourth bag that i added to my collection was my parker this is like a dark green i don't know if you can see that green in in the in in here but this is green and it's suede this actually came out in um a christmas this was out in chris around christmas time i can't remember the year but it was out in christmas so you can see it has that metallic green on this side and it has suede on the front and oops and on the handles it also has green 
So this was my, let me see, one, two, three, my fourth bag, my fourth green bag. And so you can see all of them are in different shades. Then the next one that I added was my Coach Duffel. Let's see. So this is my Coach Duffel bag. put it on this side so this is the duffel and i really wanted this bag because i had this bag in black years ago and i wanted to add this one back in my collection this one is more of a crossbody but you can put like a shoulder strap here and use it as a sh as a shoulder bag this is too big um well, this is a good size like this, but the strap is too, too small for it to be a shoulder bag for me. So I'll probably get something thicker. And I was looking at the braided strap that Sandra and Flyboy 86 showed. So I'll probably get that braided strap for this bag. But this is my um, duffel. I forgot the size, but this is the bigger size, and this is in the color green. I can't remember. Let me see if it's if I have the tag in here somewhere, because I try to keep the tags, because I am so forgetful with the names. It's in the color hunter green. So this is the hunter green. So... So that's the, let me see, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's the fifth bag. Then the sixth bag was the Ergo. This is the Coach Ergo 33. And this is in the color, let me see the color. I hope I have the tag. No, I do not. This is just a care thing. But this is the Coach Ergo in size 33. And I really love this bag. I really do. I just like it because it falls nicely against your body. And it's just like, it's it just hugs up on you, on you. I just love it. So I got the Ergo in this color and I had I have it in the natural as well. But this is the Coach Ergo 33, and this was the fifth bag, green bag, that I added to my collection. Now, the last one that I added was this Micro Kors Lita that I haven't used as of yet. So, I love, I fell in love with this bag because of the green. That and then the Micro Kors, the MK, is very subtle. Like, it's not something too much. And I like the fact that this right here is solid. So it's just a pretty little bag. It's so, so pretty. So these are all of my green bags. I do not have any more green bags. I'm just checking. Um, I do have bags that have green in it, but they are not green bags. Um, so... But this is my small green collection. So that's it. So if you want to see any particular bag like in more detail, I can gladly do a video like that. But this was just to show you Omo, my green bag collection. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, you can go ahead and press the like button. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, you can go ahead and subscribe. And I hope to see you guys soon. Adiós.